I'm moving in today. Around 2,000 students and their families flooded the University of Maine campus Friday for move-in day, many arriving from locations across the country. I'm from Cedar Grove, New Jersey. I'm um, from Chicago, Illinois. Uh, Connecticut. As freshmen filed into their new homes for the next semester, these new students and their parents were filled with a mix of emotions. I'm nervous to start college. It's a big change in my life. Uh, I'm excited for the future. It's a little tough dropping him off and leaving to go back home, but you know, he's got to be independent. We're excited to join him on this journey as he becomes himself, and uh, we're definitely pumped that he's out of the house, too. <laughs> The campus was also filled with a number of volunteers who climbed endless flights of stairs throughout the day to help newcomers. Every time I go out there, there's new cars, so we're, we're kind of quick, but like, yeah, a lot of, lot of kids. <laughs> We've been here since um, 745. As students unpacked their belongings, they took some time to reflect on what they brought along. Clothing, school supplies, and other essentials. Uh, Thank you. So these are my party shoes. I just wear them to every party in the... Everybody compliments them, they're great. That's my PlayStation up there. I'd... It's important because I use it pretty much all every day. It's an Ibanez. Uh, I got it off one of my friends. It's this pillow right here. <laughs> it's my dog. Um, I'm really going to miss her, but I think that's probably the most important thing I've hacked. As families said their goodbyes, some parents were left with a lingering question. I'm very excited for him, but I uh, don't really know who I'm going to nag now. <laughs> In Orono, David Ledford, ABC 7 and Fox 22 News.